We are excerpt number 11. Okay, read. Bar Sulam from Shamati, article 59 concerning the staff and the serpent. If his work is based on earthliness, he can always be fine. But if the basis for the work is on the discernment of bestowal, and above reason, he needs perpetual efforts so as not to fall into his root of reception and within reason. One must not be distracted for a minute, or he will fall into his root of earthliness, called dust. As it is written, for dust you are, and to dust shall you return. And that was after the sin of the tree of knowledge. One examines, if one is advancing in Kdusha, in holiness, or to the contrary, since another god is sterile and does not bear fruit. The Zohar gives us that sign that specifically on the basis of faith, called a staff, in, is one imparted fruitfulness and multiplication in the Torah. This is the meaning of the staff of Aaron Badet. The budding and growing comes specifically through the staff. Rav. Meaning, of course, we'll always have disturbances and problems and questions and even troubles. And we will always need to overcome them and to build faith above reason. Faith, uh, sorry, bestowal above reception with greater and greater disturbances. And therefore, we only need to believe that what is given to us, problems, questions, uh, it is always suited to our forces, to our ability, to, uh, to our state. The Creator wants to advance us, and that's how He does it. And we are not given any obstacles in order to push us down, but only in order to elevate us more and more and more. That is why a person should be certain that what is he is facing, he is able to overcome, he is able to attain a higher spiritual state. And we need to help one another to be all of us with such an attitude. Yes. Um.